Yeah, how's it going everyone? Post Commentary Maryland here, because as I mentioned in the last video, my friends at Pokemon, they sent me this really cool box for the Pokemon Go Pokemon TCG set, the collab set, it's really cool. But the video went a little long, so I made the decision to cut it. This covers the second half of that, which focuses on just these three box things. I think they're really cool, but just in case you're wondering what's going on, well, now you know. Anyway, let's get right into it. Okay, got stuff tidied up just a little bit. Should be good. So let's go ahead and open up the special collections. So these three are very, very similar to each other. Like, you know, there's not a lot of differences. The main differences between them are just the pin you get and the promo card on the front. But otherwise, they come with six Pokemon Go booster packs, a code card for TCG Live, the deluxe pin featuring whichever team, and then of course the full art promo card with that. Now these retail for $30 US, so not quite as good of a deal if you're just going for the packs in my opinion, because you get six in this as opposed to three in the Pokeball tins. So, I don't know. But again, if you want to represent your tin, or your team, not your tin, you get the pin with that, so that's pretty cool. And you know what? I'm going to represent my team by opening up this one first and just kind of, well, here, let's take a look at the uh, thing on the pack cam here. Yeah, yeah, it does look really neat. You know, can't go wrong with that. All right, so let's open this up. Now, we've already seen the effects of Blanche, Spark, and Candela. You know, they're the ones that let you get, well, potentially draw the two cards, you flip a coin. If, if heads, you get to attach a basic energy from the discard pile. Now, which energy depends on which of the team leaders it is. But, you know, the point is, these are the same effects as that. They just look cool. They're like the full art version. So, there's another, uh, actually, there's like six code cards in here. So that's pretty cool. I guess you get one for each pack that would be inside of one of the collection things. So yeah, we have this here. Let's go ahead and open it up. Looks nice and simple. I want to see this pin. Oh yeah, that's a that's a fancy looking pin. That does look really cool. <laughs> I like it. I like it. Should I put it on? Let's put it on. Okay, I think I got it on. <laughs> it was uh, a little hard to do just how I'm positioned, but that's uh, fine. All right, so let's get Blanche out of here. I do really like how they have this packaged. So interestingly, I don't see the uh, the code card for TCG online over there. But yeah, there's the promo, so that's pretty nice. It's a nice art of her. Maybe it's in here with the packs. Oh, yep, there it is. I found it. All right, so yeah, I think that unlocks probably that promo card on TCG Live or TCG Online. So let's open up these. Oh, here, we'll, we'll leave Blanche kind of on the side with the pack cam. All right, so six more packs. Let's see what we get. So we'll have quite a few more packs to open up this video. Um, I think that's probably, we're just gonna go for it. You know what, it's fine, it's fine. <laughs> oh man, so we got Squirtle, Pikachu, Bidoof, Charmander, Meltan, Oh, Sylveon, that's cute. Souvenir, search your deck for up to two cards and put them into your hand, that's pretty nice. And then Wonder Flash, if your opponent's active Pokemon is a dragon Pokemon, it does 90 more damage, ooh. Blastoise, yeah! Vitality Spring, once during your turn, you may search your deck for up to six energy cards and attach them to your Pokemon in any way you like? What? Then shuffle your deck. If you use this ability, your turn ends, but six energy cards. They don't even have to be basic energy cards. It's just six of anything you want. Wow, that's a really good Blastoise. Like, that's worth your turn ending for that. Like, you use that, and you're ready to go at the next turn. Like, you're ready. And then Hydro Pump, four for 90, does 30 more damage for each water energy attached to this Pokemon. So again, if you have four water energy on this to pay for that, it's going to be doing 120 more. So that's going to be 210 damage. This is a really good Blastoise. Wow. Fire energy. Whoops. There's a Blanche. 
Soul Rock. Sun Energy. Once during your turn, you may attach a Psychic Energy card from your discard pile to one of your Lunatone. Okay. Then Spinning Attack. Two for 50. That's decent. And then there is the Egg Incubator. Flip a coin if head search your deck for a basic Pokemon and put it onto your bench. And shuffle your deck. If Tails, put this Egg Incubator on the bottom of your deck instead of in the discard pile. Wait, what? Oh, then you don't get it. You get to, you like put that back in. Okay, I see how that goes. It's a little weird. Huh. So like if you fail it, it just goes away. Like it, you don't discard it essentially. It just goes back to the bottom of your deck. Try again later. All right, Eevee with the whiny voice. Pikachu is taking a walk. Buddy Bolt, Squirtle, Spinarak, Wimpod. Oh, our reverse foil of the Larvitar. Nice. Oh, there we go. Now there is a scene that if you've played any amount of Go, you know that feeling when you're looking at this. Oh yeah, Blissey just guarding one of the stadiums. Enriching Egg. Heal all damage from one of your bench Pokemon. That's actually decent. Send Headbutt's alright. Wait, how much HP does it have? 200. That's pretty good. There's a Pokestop. Another Lure Module. And camera up. Neat. All right, let's open this one up. Do, do, do. Yeah, I have to say the uh, the artwork has been pretty entertaining, and the effects are also quite nice. Like I do like them. I think that there there's some interesting stuff in here. It's not just like a filler set. At least from a cursory glance. Uh, Lolan Rattata, Wimpod, War Turtle, or Reverse Foil. Ooh, Zapdos. Oh, there we go. Okay, so this thing has a similar thing as Moltres, except for basic, um, well, it's called Lightning in the card game for some reason. But yeah, basic Lightning Pokemon's attacks, except that Zapdos do 10 more. So that's pretty cool. Definitely like that. Metal Energy, Pokestop, Camerupt, and Zatu. So I'm going to guess that the Articuno is the same except for basic water. So that's cool. Probably all sorts of stuff you could power up with those. Oh man, <laughs> a lot to think about there. All right, so Larvitar, <laughs> Sleepy Numble, like the sound is sleeping, Bulbasaur, Onyx, Beedoof, whoa, Radiant Blastoise. Oh, that's cool. That's like one of those shiny Pokemon. They're pretty rare from what I've gathered. So yeah, it's like shiny Blastoise, but it counts as a Radiant Pokemon, so this is technically a different name than Blastoise. But there's a rule box on it. You can't have more than one Radiant Pokemon in your deck altogether. So this has Pump Shot. You must discard a Water Energy card from your hand in order to use this ability. Once during your turn, you may put two damage counters on one of your opponent's bench Pokemon. That's pretty cool. Also, this is a basic Pokemon. You don't have to evolve it from anything. You only get one prize card when it's knocked out. So that's kind of nice. And then it has Torrential Cannon, three for 170, but it can't use it next turn. So that's really good. I gotta go get a sleeve on that. Oh, hey, <laughs> Moltres as well. That's a pretty nice, uh, pretty nice pack. Uh, and then there's a V-Star card. Cool, got enough of those. Uh, Blanche, Ivysaur, and Egg Incubator. Very neat. Let me get a, uh, a sleeve for that really fast. Okay, I have returned and I have sleeves now, so let's properly put this thing in a sleeve. We'll put the Blanche promo in a sleeve as well. There we go. All right, yeah, that thing needed to be in one. <laughs> okay, so anyway, let's see what else is in here. Do, do, do. All right, so we've got Nummel, we've got Tranquil, I don't think I've seen that one yet. Got Alolan Raticate, Larvitar, Natu, ooh, Rare Candy. Oh yeah, all right, that's familiar, it just looks so different. Choose one of your basic Pokemon in play. If you have a stage two card in your hand that evolves from that Pokemon, put that card onto the basic Pokemon to evolve it, skipping the stage one. You can't use this card during your first turn or on a basic Pokemon that's put into play this turn. I remember before that was a rule, like you could just do it immediately. <laughs> so 
Yeah, that was a little overpowered, but it is still very strong. Ooh, there's Venusaur. Okay, why did I set this aside? <laughs> uh, all right, so Loopy Lasso. Wow, that sounds like a Pokemon Let's Go attack name. <laughs> Once during your turn, you may flip a coin. If head switch one of your opponent's bench Pokemon with their active Pokemon, whoa, and the new active Pokemon is now asleep and poison. Wow, that thing is mean. So it's like a, a Pokemon catcher that you can just use. I mean, if you had two of these, you could flip two coins each turn and they're asleep and poison. I'm just going to say that with that Alolan Raticate, oof, that is, uh, that's pretty scary. <laughs> All right, we got a Blanche, got Ariados, and an Egg Incubator. Oh man, yeah, that Venusaur is pretty wild too. Like, that's a very powerful effect. Even if there was just a gust of wind, it'd be nice. Eat bomb! <laughs> it's dodging. Look at all those Pokeballs it's dodged. Oh my gosh. All right, well, I've had that happen a few times. <laughs> Bulbasaur, Pita, Magikarp, Onyx, Wimpod, and hey, another Melmetal V. Cool. Set that one aside. Fighting Energy, Charmeleon. Oh, another Rare Candy. That's good. And War Turtle. All right. So, yeah, that's the contents of the, uh, well, the, what is it even called? It's... <laughs> It's got a wild name, the Special Collection, and then I guess it'd be Team Mystic. So, yeah. Now, I'm gonna go ahead and open these two up. They have the same things in them, other than a different promo card and a different pin. Rather than bore you as I, like, open these all up, I'm just gonna do it and show you the stuff in it, because you've already seen one. It's just those that are the differences. So, I'll see you in just a moment. Yeah, while I'm opening these, don't forget this as the insert inside. This isn't just... A, uh, a little pamphlet thing or flyer thing for Go. This has the code cards on the back, so don't lose it. Make sure you get that from like the back of the box. Okay, I got it all unboxed and ready to go. Let's show you the stuff that you get in those two. Again, it's pretty much the same story. It's just you get the uh, Candela promo here and the Team Valor badge which, you know, definitely looks pretty cool if you're into that. I mean, I'm just saying, no, I'm just kidding. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Whatever team you're on, that's fine. You know, you got to have that like friendly banter between teams, right? Isn't that like so, so Pokemon Go? <laughs> oh, man, I remember when that first came out. It's so hard to believe it's six years old now, but I remember when it first came out, it was just like everyone was talking about it. It's like Pokemon just came out all over again, like from the very beginning, you know, the original Pokemania days of like, you know, 98, 99. Oh man, those were the days. And then Pokemon Go brought that back. So, I mean, regardless of if you like Pokemon Go or not, like I, you know, I certainly don't agree with everything, every decision they've made and all that stuff. But I also really do respect the fact that it was able to bring a lot of life into Pokemon as a series again. And that's, that's cool. So I'm thankful for that. All right, so again, each of these have six booster packs in them, so 12 all together. Let's go ahead and open these up, see what kind of fun stuff I'll get. I know this video is running a little long, but I also had no clue what was in that big box. And I figured, you know, <laughs> I, I, I don't know, I'll figure it out. So we still have more to do even after this, but hopefully this is fine as far as length goes. <laughs> well, that bee barrel. I keep seeing it, it's like, wait, that's not Bee Barrel, that's Smeargle. But yeah, so Meltan, got Magikarp again, Foil Pokestop, Blissey again. Got the V-Star card, woo! Egg Incubator, Soul Rock, Lure Module, nothing new in there. <laughs> I've had all that stuff before. Um, shoot, I don't remember, I think this was the Spark one, the Team Instinct just in case that matters to you. <laughs> All right, so we got Meltan, Charmander, Ape Bomb, got Bulbasaur, Beat of, Reverse Oil Steelix. Oh yeah, I think I've seen this thing. Oh yeah, another Venusaur, cool. Water Energy, Poke Stop, a normal Steelix, okay. And Zatu, cool. That Venusaur is 
that's something else. <laughs> oh man, yeah, I, I definitely like the effects of all three of the, the Kanto starters final evolutions. Like, they're all quite cool. You have neat things. All right, so also I just noticed the illustrator 0313. It's interesting. It's numbers. Tranquil. Bulbasaur. Natu. Ambipom. Slowpoke. Magikarp. Oh, that's a reverse foil of Magikarp. Okay. And... Ooh! That is cool. Oh, man. Let me get a sleeve on this thing. This looks really cool. I'll tell you right now, I have a feeling it'll be pretty sweet. Okay, so... Mewtwo. So, Psy Surge. Discard up to three Psychic Energy from your Pokemon. It does 90 damage for each card you discarded in this way, so that's kind of nice. Could do, like, 270. And it can be from any of your Pokemon, not just Mewtwo. And then Star Raid does 120 to each of your opponent's Pokemon V? What? Wow, that is ridiculous. Now, you can only use it once in a game. You can only use one V-Star power per game. That's what this thing's for. <laughs> you use this as like a marker to flip over like if you've used it or not. But yeah, that is extremely powerful. You could claim six prize cards quite easily with that. Dang. <laughs> that is a good card. Oh my gosh. Yeah, that thing's crazy. Spark. Ariados and Steelix. Ooh. <laughs> oh man, that Mewtwo V-Star. Jeez, I mean, Psy Surge isn't even that bad, too. If you have a good way to get Psychic Energies, like, what is it? Is it the... I'm thinking of the... It's not Spectrier, but the Shadow Rider Alarex. I think that did something with that. It's been a while, but... I know that was a very, very popular card. Onyx, Eevee, Mummel, Lone Eradicate. Ooh, Ivysaur, verse 4. Ah, Pikachu with the hat. That's cool. Psychic Energy, Rare Candy, Slowbro, and oh, there's the Lunatone. So Cycle Draw, discard a card from your hand if you do draw three cards. And then Moon Kinesis does 30 damage plus 30 more for each Psychic Energy attached to this Pokemon. Oh, you know, I think I read on Twitter some people were talking about like the Lunatone and Solarock deck, and I guess that's what makes it work, is you get the Solarock, a bunch of Solarock on the bench to keep getting back Psychic Energy, and then you just put it on that Lunatone and just do Moon Kinesis. It's kind of neat. It's a cool concept. All right, so we've got another Charmander. We've got Eevee, Natu, Ambipom, got Alolan Eradicate, got a Nummel, Hmm. I feel like I should do something with this Nummel. Like, it's really cute. I know it's just sleeping, but, you know, it's Moltres. So, I... <laughs> this is gonna sound really silly. I'm just gonna peel it. Oh, that was the mechanic I was waiting for. Oh, man. So it's this Ditto. So, yeah, Ditto is actually, like, it's on a sticker. Like, there's a... They, they did this. They actually did this. That was what I kept looking for. So, just for the record, you can see down here next to the set symbol, there's a little Ditto icon. Now, I wasn't entirely sure if it replaced the set symbol or not, so I kept, kept, like, looking down there to see, like, oh, is that, is it the ditto? But yeah, if you see this, you gotta look really carefully. You can actually peel the card right off of it. So I might have some that were in there, and I just, I wasn't paying enough attention, because I think I might have been looking at the wrong thing. But yeah, that's ditto. <laughs> that's so funny. This Pokemon can use the attacks of any basic Pokemon in your discard pile, except for Pokemon with a rule box. Pokemon V, Pokemon GX, etc. have rule boxes. So that also would count the uh, Radiant Pokemon. Still need the necessary energy to use each attack. So that is really cool. It's a very versatile ability, but wow, that was... <laughs> oh, 
Oh man, yeah, they, they had to make like a video explaining that or like a little animation, I think on Twitter. And I understand why, like it's, it's really, it's like you'd easily just gloss over it and be like, oh, wait, what? <laughs> I could easily see people not even knowing it was a ditto. Now, unlike Pokemon Go, when you get it, it's not gonna like reveal itself automatically. So yeah, I don't know if they're always reverse foils. I've actually been looking more at the non-foils. So I guess we'll have to see. I feel like there was a Magikarp that had a little different of a foil pattern. Maybe that's it. Oh, Dragonite. Oh, that's cool. <laughs> Looks so angry though. Hyper Beam, discard energy or unenergy from your opponent's active Pokemon and Buster Tail. Three for 160. That's pretty cool. I like it. Water energy. Candela, Charmeleon, and Lure Module. <laughs> oh man, I'm so glad I found that. That was really good. Oh, you know what? I completely forgot about the rest of that pack. Yeah, there was a Moltres in there. <laughs> man, I have a lot of those Moltres. Chansey and Steelix. Okay, there we go. Yeah, that ditto. That's so wild. So I think we're moving on to the Team, uh, team Valor. What is it? Special Collection? Shoot, I already threw them down there. But yeah, whatever that one box thing's called, whatever the official name for it is. I'm opening that one now. Alright, so Magikarp, Meltan, Eevee, Pikachu. Ooh, another. Wait, what? Double Charizard! Dude, this is like the luckiest pack ever, am I right? Dude, how many of you can get two Charizards in one pack? <laughs> That is pretty cool, though. Uh, yeah, one's reverse foil, the other is not. Um, well, I mean, I guess I have enough Charizards to go around. That's good. <laughs> all right, I'm not going to sleeve all of them. I really should, but... Double Charizard pack. Mmm! That is wild. <laughs> I'm still thinking of the ditto, though. I'm sorry. So Pikachu with Buddy Bolt, Wimpod, Pidove... Bulbasaur, Squirtle. Ah, look at that reverse foil of the bee barrel. Well, the smear. Well, the bee. Bar I don't know. And another Dragonite. What the heck? Double Dragonites. Jeez. And the Lunatone again. That's pretty cool. That's weird getting the two Dragonites though. I mean, it's fine. I like Dragonite. It's also really disruptive, like that first attack, Hyper Beam. Just discarding energy from your opponent's active. Like that's, that can be quite disruptive. Onyx, Charmander, Bidoof, Wimpod, Bidoof. <laughs> oh, look at that, look at that. All right, Pikachu, you gotta wait a moment. I gotta, I gotta peel my Bidoof, all right? so weird just peeling a card <laughs> oh it's so funny it's oddly satisfying though like it's really wild wow the cut on this ditto is a little wild too i don't even know how they do that like that's that's a really clever effect <laughs> oh man yeah i gotta keep an eye out so that was the reverse foil so maybe it does always replace the reverse foil so now i'm gonna need to look back you know, you're going to need to let me know in the comments how many I missed, because you probably had the eye for it, and I probably didn't. Because I think I was looking at the set symbol. I mean, I could go back, but you could also just leave a comment. <laughs> I know someone will. Someone always does. That's fine. Okay, so we've got Squirtle, Ranquil, Charmander. I'm just glad I could show that, that part off, because I think it's really, it's a funny idea. Ooh, there's Articuno. Ice symbol. Yeah, so it's basically the same thing as the others, except for water type and, of course, excluding any Articuno. So that's neat. Ah, Snorlax! Block. As long as this Pokemon is in the active spot, your opponent's active Pokemon can't retreat. And then collapse. Pokemon's now asleep. Yeah, fitting for Snorlax. Egg Incubator. Soul Rock. Spark! I guess it would make sense that it'd only be on the reverse foil, too. Because I don't know how you'd do that on, like, a normal card. Like, even doing it on a foil is pretty wild. 
Tranquil Larvitar, Natu, Ambipom, Pikachu, glad I don't have to peel the Pikachu, Gyarados, ooh, wreak havoc. Flip a coin until you get tails or each heads, discard the top two cards of your opponent's deck. Wow, and then wild splash, four for 230, and you discard the top five cards of your deck. Whoa, that's uh, very destruct destructive. <laughs> Uh, Steelix, Candela, and Charmeleon. Okay, so final pack. Final pack. I know this is taking a while, but there's a lot to, lot to see in here. That's for sure. Okay, so we've got Ambipom. <laughs> Why is that I like that? Raticate, or Lolan Raticate. Larvitar, Lolan Radita, Spinarak, Solrock. Reverse foil one, too. That's pretty cool. And another Venusaur. Very nice. Dark Energy, Chansey, Zatu, and Pokestop. Well, very cool. Yeah, definitely think the pins and, like, the promo cards are pretty cool, too. But, I, oh, yeah. The, this is where the other one is. I knew I had it somewhere. But, yeah, the pins are neat. The, uh, the cards themselves are pretty darn cool. Like, I think it's a, a neat little celebration-esque set. But it looks like there's also some pretty decent cards in there. Like, honestly, this Mewtwo, this thing. Ooh, man, that, that looks really strong. <laughs> really strong indeed. Okay, so I know I still have this stuff. I'm going to check that stuff out in another video. I think that'll be better suited for it. But anyway, I hope you enjoyed this little peek at Pokemon Go crossing over with Pokemon TCG. Like, they're both cool parts of the franchise. It's neat to see them kind of combine together. Um, I think it's it's really kind of fun. I feel like they did that, like, they touched on it before with, I think, a professor... Oh, what's his name? Willow? Um, way back. And that was kind of neat, but, you know, now they're really going for it. <laughs> no pun intended. But yeah, anyway, thank you so much to my friends of Pokemon for sending me this, this awesome box to check out all this stuff. Hopefully you've enjoyed watching this. Hopefully it gives you an idea if this is something you'd like, or if you think a friend of yours that's really into Pokemon Go, this would probably make a pretty darn good gift for them as well. But yeah, anyway, I will see you on the next video where we'll check out the Elite Trainer Box and the Eevee, the Radiant Collection Eevee, which I think will be pretty cool. So anyway, thanks for watching and see you next time, everyone.